everybody. It's Kelly with My Metamorphosis, and I'm really happy to be here with you tonight. It is, what day is it? It's Monday night, probably about 9 o'clock p.m. Um, p.m. is usually nighttime. <laughs> so I am here to share a Dollar Tree haul with you guys, and little Miss Bebe is joining us. She's been whining all day long. I don't know why. She's just having one of those days, I guess. So, um, you guys already know the pet commotion around here. So, I really should redo this video, but I'm not going to. Um, it just is going to be what it is. So, you know the drill. Sit back, relax, grab a drink, grab a snack, and let's enjoy this Dollar Tree haul together. <music> Alrighty, so if you see wiggling, excuse me. If you hear whining, excuse me. So we're gonna jump on in. Let's put this right here. All right, I think I found a little better setup. I have a little table next to me here so that I'm not constantly, um, like, you know, showing you the top of my head. All right, so, um, oh gosh, did I already show you guys? No, I didn't. So these are some poppies. They're beautiful. I love them. Love this teal color. Got those. And sorry, I put the bag upside down. So all the flowers are on the bottom. Okay. Um, and I got one of these, which is just super, super cool. It almost feels like, um, how about I show you? <laughs> a, oh my gosh, I cannot think of the, um, I guess like a chenille type of a material. So it's like really soft and um, yeah, just super cool. Love these, what are these called? Yeah, no, sorry. Kitty, I'm telling you right now. Oh, these animals. It's a willow. Um, and you know what? You know what she sees? She sees these flowers. And what she likes to do is chew on the ends of them. If I don't get them quickly, put away. Um, so, yeah. Man, am I a little irritable today, tonight? I'm sorry. I am, you know, some days it's just, some days you have neurotic pets running around and you're like, I'm so far past the toddler years with my kids. Why do we have these pets? We love them and they drive us freaking crazy. So, so yeah, um, just shenanigans all day long. All right, this is called, interesting name, Hop Bush. And these are so cool, look at them. They're just like, I don't know, they're so cool. I just think they're beautiful. So I got that color and I got this color. Look at, oh, M flipping G. So, okay, the cat. I apologize, you guys. Oh my gosh. Every single time I come on here, I'm starting to get crazy eyes. Okay? She wants to jump up here and rattle this all over the place. And it's so irritating. All right. You know how it is. It's real and raw around here. So, again, back of my mind, just re record this, Kelly. Front of my mind is like, just roll with it. All right. So, um, got this cute little notebook. You know, it's tiny, you guys. Um, it is only, let's see if it tells us how many sheets. Nope. But look at this. The daisies and the cherries and the strawberries. Just, I mean, it's adorable. They're calling it a little journal. Well, not a little, but they're calling it a journal notebook by a door. 
and so perfect for a purse oh wait I've got this one too um, I have another one somewhere too it'll be in another haul but these are um, little four foot garlands and they are I think hibiscus yeah so I got one of these I just think it's absolutely beautiful so of course it stretches out the garland um, I got uh, one of these little crossword books and I just thought this would just be, you know, if you don't want to play this on your phone, you know, you want to save your battery or whatever, and you're waiting in a doctor's office or what, whatever the case might be, this is fun to just like, it's purse size. You can just pull it out and just do some crosswords. So it's super cute. Um, 70 puzzles. And this is what it looks like, you know, just regular little crossword puzzles. And um, I got this hardback little journal. Um, I don't see it showing how many pages, but um, again, like, okay, my favorite flower is a daisy. So it's got the daisies in the background and then you can see the foil writing says, choose joy. And I just love that. It's in gold that and then I got a pack of prayer cards and I not only give these like um, you know I'll put them in a card for someone or I'll just hand once to someone if I feel that they look like they need one um, you know they're just like kind of like one of those you know right place at the right time sort of things or you know I leave them around my home or I use them as bookmarks so um, it's really cute the cover the package that it's in prayer cards um, it's got the little lemon tree looks like lavender um, inspirational prayer and scripture cards for yourself and others includes 20 cards so and then this is on the back kind of shows you what each side of the card looks like and then I got some stickers. Um, these ones are kind of like, the, they're the pop-out ones. Um, there's 12 pieces and I fell in love with these because they are, sorry about that glare. Um, they are feathers. And then I got the flowers and this is a nine piece. So pretty. And then I got some little pop out, or they're calling them pop up is what they call all of these 11 piece stickers. So these are all by Crafter Square and these are birds and owls. I mean, owls are birds, I guess. They just don't fly. Do they fly? Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm an owl lover. I should know this. Yeah, they fly. Correct me if I'm wrong. Anyway, there's those. And they almost look wooden, so I just, how cool are those? So cute. All right, guys. So, let me just get a few things put back over here so that I can grab some more items to show you. I hope everybody is doing well. I hope everyone had a wonderful Father's Day. I haven't been. All right, rudely interrupted by my alarm as usual. <laughs> so that means it's 9.45 actually. It's later than I thought, but who knows when you will be watching this. So anyway, I was saying, I hope everybody had a wonderful Father's Day. I haven't been on since Father's Day. All right, um, I fell in love with this. It's just one of the little notebooks or journals that has the elastic. And, um, you know, if you had the right tools, you guys, like these would be so easy to make. But anyway, look at those beautiful flowers. And it says here, good thoughts. I love that. This one is, is uh, 60 sheets and um, it's lined inside. So I was due for some new journals to just kind of have here, have there. Um, you know, I, I wish that this was bigger, but I was so excited to find this. Um, it's so beautiful. 
You got the moons and it's very, you know, celestial and just beautiful. And this is, you know, one of the crown jewels. Um, so it's a planner, so you can, it's got like the weeks there and then it's got even got um, moods and um, goals right there. What else does it have in here? Oh, I think that's what it has throughout the whole thing. It does. Except for it also, like, every couple of pages has some blank pages with lines. All right. Um, and then I got a... Um, Oh, wow, baby. I see that you got a hold of the corner of this. <sighs> These are the type of shenanigans I'm talking about that just really, um, really burn my tush, okay? They just do. <laughs> Whatever saying that is. Anyway, okay. So this is a composition notebook. It's the really cool little, um, like, recycled kind of looking notebook. And I love the magenta color. And um, it says, today's your day. Today is your day and it's just um, you know lined and then on the inside of these they have um, you know because these are used used for school usually so um, you can put your name your address your email your teacher your homeroom your class schedule all that kind of good stuff there all right let's move these flowers out of the way Okay, now, like I said, before I got back on here doing um, videos again, I had, of course, I didn't stop shopping at the Dollar Tree, so um, I was, you know, still buying things and um, I'm putting them away. So I actually have, I'm just not gonna take them off the wall right now, but I'm looking at them right now. Some really cute black mirrors like this um, in a different style. Um, and then I will be showing you a couple others that I have as well that I haven't put up yet. But anyway, I love these. They remind me of wicker and <laughs> they are, gosh, how am I going to show you this without a massive glare? Okay. So anyway, you can see the shape there and you know, they're black plastic, but when they're on the wall, got two of those when they're on the wall. You know, they look a little more high-end. Um, not that, like, I'm not a high-end girl, okay? I mean, look at the couch I'm sitting on. <laughs> but anyway, um, but you know, like, I don't, move out of the way, Bay. you're shaking this. Um, you know, but I don't want to look like I have plastic mirrors on my wall either, so. All right, got two of these. You guys know, there's no rhyme or reason to the way I pull things out of these bags. It just comes on out and I show you. Got two of these, one is already in the cupboard. They're just the little designer ultra plates. I'm telling you, you guys, if you have not, they don't always have the designer ones that are Dollar Trees, but they always have the white ones. They're great plates. If you think about like, okay, 10 plates, you know, in a package, you're like, oh, that's not gonna last us, right? But the way I try to think about it is, say I get three packs, I'm getting, well, not three dollars for 30 anymore but you know 375 for 30 and you know that's doable so anyway got two of those um let's see got two of these now i realize that these are wreath forms um but i'm not using them for that i am putting them on my Oh gosh, what can I, hi baby, what can I put behind here? These animals are so out of sorts, you guys. And they're even more out of sorts because they're making me out of sorts and they know I'm irritated with them. Okay, so um, anyway, that's what it looks like. And I'm putting it on my wall as is. Now, I also have two, so I got two of these. Um, I have two, can you see one of them? No, it's way over there. Um, galvanized stars that are like the, um, 
I forget what they're called. They're like, the way they're cut, where they're not flat, they kind of like, if you laid them down, they would be like a dish, you know? Why can't I think of what that's called? Anyway, they have, um, you know, like a 3D effect to them or whatever. So, um, and then they have like little, um, you know, jute or rope, whatever on the top, you know, and you can hang them. Well, I thought that they would be really, really cute. Like, just hang it right there and then it'll, I think it'll hang about right where that is. So that's my plan for those. And if I remember, I'll show you. All right. Let's see. Um, you guys know I'm a headband girl obviously and I got this and I just fell in love with it it's kind of this patent leathery um, look and it's cream colored you know I love the ones with the knots on the top get down get down um, I got these because they were out of poop bags so we are improvising and this is just 150 count of the fold top um you know storage bags sandwich bags so i don't know maybe that's a better deal than the poop bags i'm not sure we're gonna check that out um and you guys have heard me say if you've seen my last couple of hauls that i have incorporated the stuff into our living room which is beachy um, but i do love all the bee stuff and the Dollar Tree is just knocking it out of the park with all their bee items. So this one is one that you can either hang or lay that down. Um, and it's, you know, again, like the little uh, bottle or what have you is almost looks like a beehive. And then there's that little bee on the front, just like a little charm. So yeah, got one of those, just got a clear one. Excuse me. Um, I was super excited to find these. I really hope the other straw is in here. Or did I just happen to grab one that didn't have two straws? I don't know. Anyway, um, hold on a minute. Oh, maybe they're not color changing. They just look like um, they're color changing. So, um, uh, the both of the cups at the two packs say or uh, read life is a beach enjoy the waves so um and i love the mint green and they're pretty big um again, again it's a two pack and they come with straws but see there's one missing there and then these are oh my gosh i need to have my glasses on um it may say what size these are but i don't know they're a pretty good size got this for baby oh my gosh what's that bay baby <laughs> baby what's this so she knows i get all her stuffies from um the dollar tree okay i'm gonna tell you right now she tears bleep up okay but she's now down here looking she's like give me my new friend but she will not tear up her stuffies Okay, she is so nice and sweet and gentle with them. She only tears up my stuff, okay? So anyway, got this little, you know, stuffy baby doll. I mean, look at her. So cute, all right? So we're going to take this tag off. Ouch. Oh, sorry, you guys. My finger is jacked up. Um, and there you go, Bay. Oh, I wish you guys could see her. Oh my God. Okay, this is when I feel so bad that I get so mad at her sometimes. Oh, 
I'm a mean, I'm a mean fur baby mama. She is over there like petting it and licking it and just getting a little rough with it and then petting it and then licking it. <laughs> you know what? The joy of being a dog. All right, guys, <laughs> baby, you like, you like that? <laughs> oh my gosh, come here. Look at her. Oh, baby, come here. I'm not, no one's going to take it from you. Here, come here. No one's going to take it from you. That's yours. It's okay. Oh my gosh, you guys. So, um, the only thing I have more than headbands in the world are canvas pictures. <laughs> so, but you know what, you guys, if you're into these canvas, um, wall hangings, like I am, you will justify it like I do because they always come out with super cool ones and I cannot pass them up. I mean, look at this. Are you serious right now? Look at her. The colors of my bedroom and you know that I just have to have this in my bedroom, okay? And um, it's probably this one is like the, you know, pretty normal size that they have. Now this one is a tiny bit smaller, but I fell in love with this too. Um, and I think I'm gonna put this in, maybe I thought it was a little more red and I was gonna put it in the, um, oh my gosh, the, the kitchen, you know, the place where you cook. Um, and it kind of does look more red on here, but as I look closer, it's almost like there is kind of like a, a little bit of a reddish in there, but there's like some coral and some like some corally pink. And so I don't know, I think it could go either way, the kitchen or my room. Um, but I just thought that that was really cool. I love that so much. So yeah. There's that. All right, so as I was saying, bee stuff, um, sweet or kind, sweet, humble, um, definitely got that. Um, oh goodness, kind of farmhousey look. Um, and this dark brown and um, it says the same thing around, of course, the picture of the bee, and it is a lantern, and you guys already know, always check for these tabs. Oh my gosh, I have makeup under my fingernails. That's disgusting. All right, let's see if this works. Uh, how do I do this? Oh my gosh, what do I do? You guys, how do you turn this on? What the heck? This is weird. What in the... There we go. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? I love that. So cute. Okay, this is a really weird switch. Oh, I see. Okay. Alrighty. Um, I've been collecting these too. I can't help it. Now they've got more out. If you haven't looked, go look down the bag aisle. So um, they're just the little juncture crossbody ba bags. And look at this gray uh, buffalo check one. Oh my gosh, you guys. I just love them. They zip. Perfect for just, you know, grabbing something, um, a few things and sticking them in here if you don't want to carry your big purse or if you want to have your big purse in the car and just carry this one out. And they're all that kind of material, so you can wipe them clean if something gets on to them. Um, and then I've never gotten one of the canvas print this um, shape before, so I'm not sure 
oh yeah, it goes this way because there's the beach and there's the water and I just love that and the sky. I think I was pretty sure it went that way, but it definitely doesn't go that way. So, yeah, so there's that. I apologize for the glare. All right. I have a pack of these that I already started using that are in um, brighter colors, and these are the pastels. And there's three Jot, you know, brand, the brand is Jot, three piece uh, bookmark set. One of them says, love begins with you. You make, the other one is, you make life beautiful. And the other one is, do small things with great love. I love those. I love how they have different colored tassels on them. And they're like a, um, like a thicker, like plasticky type um, material. Okay, guys, hold on. Where are we at? Um, 17 minutes. I'll be right back. Okay, I think we're going to be good for about 10 more minutes. I really don't like to do the videos any longer than like 35-ish minutes because if I do, then I have uploading issues. All right. So, um, sorry guys, hold on one sec. Okay, so I already have one of these and I needed another or wanted another. So I also have the matching um, pot holders and I'm just using them as decor. So um, this is kind of like a goldish, color thankful and blessed with the gingham um, it's teal so our kitchen is red and teal I've told you guys this before if you've been with me for a while um, black brown a little bit of gray anyway <laughs> and then I have butterfly stickers gosh we've had them on here since we moved in I, I put them on right as we moved in um, four years ago here um, and they're from the Dollar Tree. They are on our cabinets and they have kind of like all of those colors in there too. All right, so um, I have some of these that I use as, um, like actually use as towels, but I got some for decor as well. Uh, it says this kitchen is seasoned with love and I love that like garlandy type wreath or not whatever anyway and there's a little salt and pepper stuff down there so I got two of those all right um so I was really excited to find this I love pineapple stuff like I love pineapple decor and I love pineapple juice and I love pineapple flavored things uh, kind of depending on depending but anyway um so this is a little pineapple nourishing lip balm by beauty intuition this was new to me um it is cruelty free um but anyway look at this you guys oh my gosh it's so stinking cute let's go ahead and open it up are you playing with your baby huh baby so you guys these look like in fact, I thought it was the same um, brand, and maybe it is. It's got to be. I just maybe never paid attention to the brand before. Of all of those other ones that are in the makeup section, especially around holidays, they've got like flowered ones and this and that, and some are clear, some are red, some are pinkish or whatever. Um, I'm pretty sure this is the same, because look, the same brand. Maybe not, but anyway... This is pretty heavy duty, and so are the other ones. Like, they're not chintzy at all. Oh, <laughs> oh, wait a minute, hold on, hold on. What in the, oh no. Oh, hold up, you guys. What in the world? I'm so confused right now. What in the, what in the, okay. 
right after I said this is heavy duty, <laughs> I pulled this off thinking I broke it. Okay, it almost looks like a little toilet paper roll thing. But look at it. this, the chapstick is right there. Now, I'm trying to figure out, oh, it definitely smells like pineapple, it smells amazing. I'm trying to figure out how in the heck you, it does not want to twist up, okay? I'm gonna to try to push it from the bottom here. Please let me know, oh, sh shoot. If you guys know, If you guys know, tell me, please. This is so bizarre. And I think I just pushed this in a little bit and it's not supposed to go in. So how do you get it to go up, you guys? Okay, if you have one of these, please in the comments, let me know and let me know if I'm being dumb right now, okay. We don't have time for all that right now. Okay, so I'm sure you've seen these lately. There's two different uh, designs at our stores. I can't remember what the other one is, to be honest with you, but I thought the cherry one was absolutely cute. And I love this like bright green and they're foot files. So that's the, just the design side. And then you can see the shape of it. It's like a, almost like a shoehorn. And what I love about it, you guys, is it is like, big you know to where you can like really get everything at once um in the shower or wherever i don't know if this should go in the shower to be honest with you because this right here i don't know hold on well maybe it's not just a piece of paper on there i don't know but anyway yeah get some sloughing lotion and then use this bad boy and that would be awesome Okay. All right, I thought I had another one in there. So I got this little crossbody bag as well. Look at the pretty pink and it's got um, the tie dye and I just absolutely love this. For $1.25, you guys, come on. You cannot, you just cannot pass it up. Okay. Um, so I am just a, um, little girl in a big girl's body. <laughs> so, um, in my room, I have like, I, I think shortly before, um, I took like, a break from YouTube. I, this last time I told you guys I was incorporating woodland type things into my room. Okay. Which I still am. I've got, you know, like deer raccoons whatever okay it's super cute but i also started collecting these little things and putting them in my room um because i have this monstrous dresser almost hutch type thing but it's long and it's got lots of shelves um excuse me and i just couldn't pass her up um and this is from disney jr and this is, of course, Daisy, Daffy's gal. Look at her with the pink and purple and her little ice cream and her little. <laughs> so yeah, so she'll go in my room somewhere. I gotta stop buying this stuff, I'm telling you what. Okay, and then I fell in love with this headband. Um, it is just, oh my gosh, I mean, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful satiny look bright vibrant hippie colors and of course the knot at the top it's got orange and hot pink and oh my gosh i love it so much all right i always get these in the cherry and this time i thought i would try the breeze um scent so this is cool scents you pop the top you can smell it here and then you just you know you can put it wherever in your car, you know, on your dash, you can put it um, in a cup holder, you can, whatever little nook and cranny, under your seat, whatever. So I thought it actually smelled really good. Oh yes, yum. Oh my gosh, it smells even better now that I'm like in my home and not in a store where 
I'm smelling like other things around or whatever. Does that make any sense? <laughs> You're like, what would you be smelling in the store, Kelly? I don't know. Maybe I'm just able to concentrate more. If you're like me and you have sensory overload, if it's too loud, you can't smell anything the way <laughs> it's supposed to be smelled. Oh my gosh, God help me. Okay, we're almost done. Um, I got one of the Power Stick um, deodorants. Now, I thought that this, so, you know, anything lavender catches my eye. Um, I thought this would be great just to have, you know, in my purse. Um, but I thought that it was antiperspirant slash deodorant. It is not. So beware. Be aware and beware. Make sure you take a close look at these, okay? Any any deodorants, really, okay? I just took the top off. But um, I don't even care because the smell is... Oh, so e even better. It's lavender vanilla. So um, I'm typically not a gel person, but it doesn't matter because cause it honestly, it makes me sweat. It feels like it makes me sweat more. But um, I thought it was an antiperspirant deodorant and I would use it like as a touch up if I needed it. But it's not. It's just deodorant. So it's definitely going to go in my purse and definitely just going to be a touch up thing. So, so yeah, but um. You just roll it up at the bottom and it comes in this cute little clear package. All right. Um, I'm gonna give a review on this as I show you this. So I got two of these, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, I couldn't remember if I had gotten the luminescence wax cubes before from the Dollar Tree. Um, you know, and I, and if I had just not liked them and that's why I didn't buy them again, or if I just had never tried them. Well, um, as good as some of them smell in here. And I mean, I'm talking even better than some of the Walmart ones. Nope. Don't waste your money. Let me know if you guys know of a scent there that does smell once you put it in the warmer because these ones don't. Oh my gosh, it, it smells so good though, it's so disheartening. So this is the basil and mint one. Now, I will say, because these almost look identical. So I don't think that I tried the basil mint one. I think I tried, it's like the one of the aromatherapy ones that I showed you, but they look alike and they smell similar. So, but anyway, I don't know if it's all of them that don't work, you know, that they just, they don't have a good throw or what, but oh my gosh. But I'm going to find something to do. I'm going to be TikToking or I'm going to be YouTubing or something to figure out how can you upcycle or whatever, or really make these pop because the smell is there. It's just not coming out. Um, once you, once it hits that warmer and then I got my favorite and such a great deal. My, my cellar cleansing water. Um, it's by bath and beauty. Um, this is what I use it for you guys. Okay. So I use it to take off my eye makeup. Okay. But it says gently removes makeup and impurities. I know people do use it on their face. I don't. Um, I'm not opposed to that. I just buy it for my, my eye makeup. Cleanses and hydrates all in one. So there's no rinsing needed, no alcohol, and no residue. And I'm telling you right now, you can spend a pretty penny on my cellar water. This works just fine and you're saving bank because it is also a nice large bottle. It's eight fluid ounces and it lasts forever. Okay? Like the sand lot forever <laughs> so so yeah I don't know about smell but yeah no smell I and mean, I think that's typically how it is anyway all right you guys I think we made it through everything and I'm so 
um, excited to get this uploaded and get it out to you guys. And um, if you haven't subscribed, um, you know what, before I say this, I want to say thank you so much to all of my friends who are, you know, my YouTube sisters, my subscribers who have um, really stuck with me through like a lot of, it's been kind of, you know, a roller coaster of a ride for um, this YouTube journey of mine. Um, so thank you guys for loving, gosh, I'm emotional today. Let's just not get cryy, Kelly, but um, thank you for supporting me through this journey. <clears throat> and to all my new subscribers, thank you guys so much for joining me this short time I've been back on. I want to say that I've gained 10 new subscribers and I'm so excited. And I just hope that you will continue this journey with me. Um, you know, it's, it's real. I have flub ups and I'm just, you know, want to have fun with you guys and, um, do this together. So thank you for joining this family and thank you guys for supporting me, all of you. And, um, if you haven't subscribed, please think about it. You know, if you like this content, you like my channel, just join us and have fun and, and we'll do this thing together. Um, hit that, that notification bell so you can be notified every time I upload a video. And most importantly, please comment down below. I want to get to know you. I want to hear from my subscribers, my friends, um, whom I've, who, you know, have been here with me, um, from the get go and those who have hopped on along the way. And I want to meet my new subscribers. So please say hi below and, um, gosh, let's see the next a haul will probably or the next video will probably be another Dollar Tree haul because I've got more to show you so stay safe stay blessed my butterflies and I will see you very soon bye